An interstellar intruder has been spotted in our solar system. While we all go about our daily lives in peace, this mysterious visitor is racing through our cosmic home from the depths of space. And this time, we discovered it in time. What's behind it? What exactly this object is? And why this discovery is so revolutionary, you'll find out in this video. So make sure to stick around until the end. A warm welcome, everyone. Oumuamua. I'm sure many of you are familiar with the name of this interstellar visitor, right? Feel free to write me a comment if you remember this hard-to-pronounce chunk from the depths of the Milky Way. Well, and now it looks like we have a Oumuamua 2.0. By the way, if you always want to be informed about groundbreaking discoveries like this, make sure to subscribe right now. Subscribing doesn't cost anything at all. You'll never miss another video and you'll be helping out. And if you're already subscribed, I'd really appreciate a thumbs up. Maybe we can hit 5,000 likes. That way, the YouTube algorithm will show this video to even more people. Alright, now let's head into space. More precisely, into the inner solar system, where a pretty extraordinary spectacle is currently taking place. On July 1st, astronomers made a discovery that blew even the most seasoned space researchers away. The Atlas Telescope Network in Chile discovered an object that was initially given the rather unspectacular name A11PL3Z. Astronomers are really very creative when it comes to naming new objects. But what happened next was anything but ordinary. The more the scientists analyzed the trajectory of this mysterious chunk, the clearer it became. This thing doesn't come from around here. David Rankin from the Catalina Sky Survey summed it up. It became clear that this object was moving through the solar system on a hyperbolic trajectory. The trajectory has an eccentricity of more than six. That's the highest ever observed. But what does that actually mean? A hyperbolic trajectory is, so to speak, the opposite of what we normally see in our solar system. Planets, asteroids, and comets usually move in rather elliptical orbits around the sun. They are virtually trapped in our cosmic neighborhood association. But an object on a hyperbolic orbit is just visiting, whizzing through once, and then disappearing forever into the infinite vastness of space. This orbit therefore suggests that the object originated from outside the solar system, from the interstellar expanses of our Milky Way galaxy. NASA has now officially confirmed the object's interstellar origin and named it 3I Atlas. The 3I stands for Third Interstellar, as it is actually only the third known visitor from interstellar space that we have ever discovered. After the famous Oumuamua in 2017 and the comet 2I Borisov in 2019, we now have another cosmic tourist. And what a one it is. 3I Atlas, with an estimated diameter of up to 24 kilometers, is significantly larger than its predecessors. For comparison, Oumuamua was only about 400 meters long, and Borisov had a core diameter of just half a kilometer. So our new visitor is a real heavyweight. This isn't a Dachshund, it's a full-grown Doberman. What's with all these dog comparisons, anyway? No one really knows. Things get especially interesting when we take a look at what kind of object 3I Atlas actually is. While Oumuamua was probably a cigar-shaped asteroid and Borisov was clearly a comet, it is not yet entirely clear what our new guest is. Jonathan McDowell from the Harvard-Smithsonian Center for Astrophysics explains, the fact that we see some blurring suggests that it is mostly ice and not rock. And that probably makes 3I Atlas an interstellar comet, and a pretty active one at that. Astronomers have already observed a faint tail and a kind of comet shell around the object, and that's a relatively sure sign that the sun's heat is starting to vaporize the ice on the surface. The activity is still relatively weak compared to what is yet to come, as 3I Atlas has not yet arrived. The object is currently located between Jupiter and Mars and is racing toward the inner solar system at a speed of over 60 kilometers per second. That's so fast that you could jet from Earth to the Moon in less than two hours. Incredible. For comparison, a Dachshund only reaches speeds of up to 20 kilometers per hour. Okay, okay, I'll stop with the weird comparisons. The most exciting moment is still ahead of us. On October 29th this year, 3I Atlas will reach its closest point to the Sun. This so-called perihelion is approximately at the height of Mars' orbit, about 206 million kilometers from the Sun. At this point, the comet will reach its maximum speed of 68 kilometers per second, fast enough to escape the Sun's gravitational pull and disappear into space forever. And the best thing is, on its way to the Sun, 3I Atlas will whiz past Mars on October 3rd, coming quite close, only about 31 million kilometers away. That sounds like a lot, but in astronomical terms, that's basically a stone's throw. There's even a chance that probes like the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter could take photos of this interstellar visitor. 
Just imagine that images of an object from another star system taken by a robotic probe orbiting another planet. I also think it's wild to realize what an incredible coincidence that is. It is already unlikely that an interstellar object will reach the solar system at all, that it will then whiz past our space probe so close is crazy. For us here on Earth, however, the best time for observation will come after perihelion, as Richard Mussel from ESA explains the comet will be visible again from Earth from the beginning of December 2025. By then, 3i Atlas should have developed a magnificent tail due to increased solar activity. But what exactly makes this discovery so special? You might say, it's just some chunk of ice from space. And for that, I interrupted the Dachshund Club meeting. Yeah, interstellar objects are extremely rare. They give us a unique insight into other star systems. Mark Norris from the University of Central Lancashire sums it up. These visitors offer scientists a rare opportunity to study something outside our solar system. For example, if we were to discover precursors of life such as amino acids on such an object, it would give us much more confidence that the conditions for life exist in other star systems. Let's remember that we currently have no way of sending even unmanned probes to other star systems. So when objects from these star systems come to us, it's like hitting the jackpot. Incidentally, the speed of 3i Atlas is record-breaking. The interstellar visitor is moving significantly faster than both Oumuamua and Borisov. This high speed suggests that it may originate from a very distant star system or that it has been accelerated by the gravitational pull of a massive object. The object's trajectory is also particularly fascinating. 3i Atlas appears to be coming from the direction of the galactic disk. This means that it probably originates from the densely populated area of our Milky Way where most stars are found that makes his journey all the more remarkable. Somehow, who knows what he's already seen on his interstellar trip. Red giants, white dwarfs, stellar black holes, inhabited exoplanets with an intelligent Dachshund alien species. Anything is possible. Unfortunately, it probably won't be possible to send a space probe to him. He's simply too fast and was discovered too late for that. But intensive observation from Earth and Mars will still provide us with valuable insights. Astronomers will try to analyze the composition of the comet determine its rotation, and thus learn more about its home system. By the way, it's also fascinating that computer models show that at any given time, up to 10,000 interstellar objects could be passing through our solar system. Most of them, however, are far too small and too dark to be detected, or they are way out in the Oort cloud. But with new, more powerful telescopes like the Vera C. Rubin Observatory, that could soon change. Could that be about to change? Maybe we'll soon be discovering new interstellar visitors every month. The next few months are definitely going to be super exciting for the astronomy community. As 3i Atlas approaches the Sun and becomes increasingly active, telescopes all around the world and in space will be tracking its every move. Who knows what secrets it will reveal to us. So folks, keep your eyes open and look up at the sky from time to time. Even if you probably can't see 3i Atlas with the naked eye, it's still kind of a fascinating thought that a piece of a distant star system is currently passing through our cosmic home up there, isn't it? If you don't want to miss anything about this story, make sure to subscribe to the channel now and don't forget to give a thumbs up so we can hit 5,000 likes. And now, let's travel to another object that's orbiting in our solar system, Voyager 1. This veteran NASA space probe has discovered a gigantic wall of fire at the edge of our solar system, with temperatures reaching up to 50,000 degrees. What is this mysterious barrier that surrounds us? You can find everything about it and fascinating visualizations of this wall of fire in the video shown. Be sure to check it out by clicking in the top right corner or... And as always, you'll find another super exciting topic related to space and science at the bottom right. Otherwise, I'd say see you in the next video. Woof, woof. Um, I mean, take care, everyone.